Um, it's incredible. It's like nothing I've ever done. You know, it's rare that a car is like your accessory, and to be gifted with such beautiful ones and be able to experience a, a, another much bigger luxury than I've ever experienced before is amazing. So. I think about Hollywood and films and just, you know, these Hollywood icons in a, an iconic car. I think they have mystery. Um, you know, I've... I get to play the Bond girl, I get to play the sexy mystery woman and normally I'm more of the ragged bohemian. <laughs> uh, I think that German luxury is very strong and bold. I'm not sure there is a challenge for collaborating with Mercedes-Benz. I think that it's such an iconic brand and something that, you know, it's always represented luxury to me and something that, you know, is so timeless that just trying to, I think, maybe trying to carry out that timeless quality and also bringing a modern edge to it as well in the times that we are, we're in. I don't know, I remember always seeing, you know, I, th I think watching old movies and seeing um, these just glamazons and these just amazing actors driving Mercedes and kind of also old Hollywood glam, I think. Car uh... I don't really know. I feel like every time I see a new car, <laughs> new car, it's more futuristic. I think that, you know, I've there'll definitely be a way of turning a car into more of a eco-friendly and still, you know, fast and and fun and sporty. So that might be the car of the future. It's amazing. Secret, secret dream would to be a Formula One champion. Never gonna happen. But, um, you know, I have such respect for them and what they do and to be able to go out there and really, you know, you, you have to be completely crazy to do what they do and fearless. Um, this is, this is very much, you know, it's, it's, we're creating a story without actually having a story, and I think also, you know, it's, in, I get to kind of play the bong girl. Um, they're so beautiful, and the the new uh, GT is, you know, it, they've been able to take this brand new mod modern car and really, it has a vintage quality, which is so, so amazing and so, I think, true to the Mercedes brand. Um, the vintage one is, you know, it's back to the future. It's timeless. It's, in, it's one of those things that you just stare at and... It's beautiful. Fashion is kind of where it all began. I used to be a ballet dancer and um, always wanted to be an actress and it was kind of a nice way of bringing both together, having movement and being able to create this character and being able to collaborate with incredible artists like Collier and any photographer who has this vision and being able to 
make a story through an image or through a moving image now. Everything has to be comfortable. Less is, less is more. I'm a little bit of a tomboy, but I like that kind of girly aspect. So, like, adding a little bit of a relaxed side to something a little bit more flower child, if you will. <laughs> It depends. I, I have like different areas of different places and I think that, you know, a lot of different cities that I go to um, influences my style and how I feel and how like I, I won't dress the same as I will in LA or New York or Paris. It all depends on like really feeling out an area and um, just the way people are it, the different cultures in different cities, I think, influences how every, everything that, you know, how you wake up in the morning and how you put yourself together. Um, you know, Paris is one of those places that is really kind of influenced how I look at women, I think, and, and, and what I admire and also also men and how they put themselves together. I have a fascination with men's style because I love their kind of, which also I think very much influences my style because I love how they have more of a uniform and it's, it's a little less thought out. Um, God, I mean, this has to be one of them. This is kind of, a crazy dream that, that um, I feel really lucky to be in Germany. I feel re really lucky to be working with a brand that um, is so iconic. You've watched it grow through time and kind of like mold into like the different periods that we're in and it very much kind of um, runs parallel to the fashion world as well. It does its thing and it kind of, I always say that a car is very much part of somebody's style. I love racing. I'm a very fast driver. I kind of, I have no patience for like slow people. I also don't understand when people drive, buy fast cars and don't drive them fast. <laughs> I think a woman needs to own a, a good stiletto, like black stiletto, um, and a good pair of jeans as well, black pair of jeans. Um, what else should a woman own? I always think a good gray sweatshirt, like a hoodie or throwover is always kind of key. Um, men just need a really good suit, a fitted, tailored suit. I think there's nothing sexier.